So a little while back, I got to go see Zap in concert. Now I can remember hearing Zap music when I was younger on WDAO radio when it was at 107.7 on the FM dial and at the old Romar skating rink in Germantown, Ohio. These songs were part of my audible landscape of my childhood. Now WDAO is gone from 107.7 and uh, Romar skating rink is no more, but Zap music is carrying on. Now during the show, they were intentional about including some moments to talk about their faith in God. When they lost their brother Roger, it was an enormous blow to not only the family, but the whole community. When the gold records stopped coming, it was a blow to their confidence. But Lester Troutman stated clearly, loudly, and for all to hear that God is real. When times were tough and it looked like Zap was finished, God sustained their spirits. I sat in awe of these guys, taking not just random jabs at it, but making three parts of the show specifically for the point of talking about God. Zapp and Roger had a string of hits that could have easily filled in a healthy set list, but they chose to speak the name of Jesus and give credit where credit is due. I was at a Zapp concert, but they took us to church. I know they were pointing to God, but that also says something about their character that they would take time out to do this. For all of us there, this was a great model for how God is not to be kept on the side and only reached out to in times of trouble. God is in the relationship business and his desire is for us to bring him with us at all times and in all situations. A relationship is constant and ongoing. Yes, he's there in times of our trouble, but our desire to see him work in our lives should not be restricted to when we want him to fix things. His desire is for our heart to be so fixed on him that he is a part of every step and every breath. First Chronicles 16:11 says, "Seek the Lord, his strength, seek his face continually." The idea is that we keep our focus on God and his mission at all times and not just when we reach a low spot. The guys from Zap know what it means to hit those low spots and they were quick to give credit to God for bringing them through it all. Thank you, Troutman family. I went to a Zap concert for the music, but you inspired my spirit as well. Exploring the elements of faith can be a lifelong pursuit. Knowing what questions to ask can be the hard part. If you like what you saw here in this video, be sure to like and subscribe on YouTube or like and follow on my Facebook page. My goal is to have a new video uploaded every week. More importantly, I'd love to hear from you. Share your thoughts with me about what the video means to you, or if you have a faith question or video suggestion, send me a message about it. I'm not going to tell you that I have all the answers, but I seriously enjoy the exploration process, and especially with others. In addition to YouTube and Facebook, you can also find me on Twitter and Instagram, or my written blog on Tumblr by searching at Rev Chris Hall. Please feel free to share this video if you think someone else could benefit from it, and thanks for watching.